Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was raised from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now on my channel, I show how the whole world is mapping out exactly how the end of days is coming, that the Lord Jesus Christ did make all of the worlds and he put the sand in the right place and that now that we are reaching the end of the age and our technology and wisdom has been increased we can see his handiwork all around us this is the earth right here this is Google Earth and right here is Antarctica Jesus Christ says that he is the foundation of the world the lamb slain from the foundation of the world to rise as a lion perfectly right here on this side you can see the lion and on this side you can see the lamb dead his eyes right there his mouth and his two ears perfect there's no way to fake this this is right here now that we have just proven the Word of God perfectly we can move on and up our understanding and look for more naturally as humans we're gonna say okay this is it we will naturally limit God instead of making him God and say he can do everything that all of your life has been designed by him to mold you just like this so now we can move on well in the Bible it talks of a great head wound happening to begin the end of days right here in between South America and Africa you can see the perfect face of a man right here perfect and he is getting a head wound just like this he is getting a head wound here and then something is coming out of the back of his head in the Bible it talks of what would be known as the little horn rising to bring about the new world order right here just like this so we verified the Word of God completely now South America is in the shape of the person that I keep showing that's coming that looks just like this perfect looks like this with his hair out to the side and he comes and he smashes into the head of the old world order just like that BAM this is supposed to happen down near Southern California just like when Sodom and Gomorrah fell this is when the rapture happens the head wound of the Bible BAM after this in the Bible it talks of the little horn rising Africa is in the perfect shape of the little horn rising right here to bring about the mark of the beast the new world order just like this so you can't fake this this is all perfect every single thing right here and it matches scripture perfectly the best thing to do is to go outside and to call the Lord Jesus as much as you can scream and yell in the air and tell him to write your name in the book of remembrance so all that's right there well here is a, another map and it matches you can see the man's face right here just like this boom perfect this guy comes smashes into the head wound and then he actually goes into Obama and he blows up half the planet to begin World War three and then the new or the little horn rises to chase down all the rest of the Christians perfect matching scripture all right there this even matches some hieroglyphs I've broken down before just like this one of Akhenaten which resembles like Obama here but you can see this man right here in red coming down with the V that's him 
causing the head wound. He goes into this door, which represents Obama. He has the key to the abyss. He launches the nukes. This is down near Camp Pendleton in San Onofre, where this happens. It will cause great earthquakes. The heart machine is ready also. Then he is off and running on this red bull. And Russia rises up, this bear. They will consume the papacy, and the Russian Orthodox Church will chase down the rest of the Christians. Russia has become all of the, it is, almost all of Russia now is what is known as the Russian Orthodox Church. It is like an offshoot of the Catholic Church, prepared by the Jesuits. All of this is in the Bible, and this will all happen. This is even what would be known as the Day of the Rapture, right here, all of that. So that's matching each and everything that we've shown here. Well, let's go show some more things deeper in here in Washington. Well, this is Washington, D.C. I show this one all the time of how you can see everything from above. The spiritual realms control everything. A human being is known as a host. Jesus showed that one man had a bunch of demons known as legion in him up to 2,000 demons in one person. So even when a person is working and drawing and being in architecture, things will control the people and all of this gets done. No, no matter what the person thought who was designing the road or the city, this all ends up being done by the spirits, by the spiritual realms. But you can see Jack in the box here. And the Bible says he comes with this host, Eucharist, that prospers for a time, which could be up to three and a half years of this person, this little horn coming out of this box. It takes a giant event to get him out of the box and begin the Great Tribulation, like when that stone falls, the head wound of the Bible, and then that's when the dead rise, the Great Tribulation begins. All of this right here. So now this is with North as North. Well, let's turn this over. And let's take a look at some deeper things that we haven't shown before and show all of the different things inside of here showing about the mark of the beast, showing even some vampires and about the star systems of the Draco star systems and the dog star Sirius and the Pallades, which all should be true for the Bible to be real. Jesus did not just create Jerusalem. He created all of the the universe. So let's dig in here and show some more things. Okay, this is Washington with South as North. So let's dig in here and show some things. One of the easiest things to see is right down here near the White House is this alligator head. We're going to show what this is. See this gator head right here? everything perfectly matching. This is even his tail and his body with his feet. You have the gator head, easy to see. And then you have the body with the tail, all right here. This is showing what's coming. This is part of the little horn of the Bible with these things like that Eucharist he made everybody eat. Now, I've shown him before, or her, that they always make him or her look like they has this one little ear sticking out, like the little horn. This big thing, right here, with no eyes, a bat, and this big funky hat on there, like a cube hat or something. But it has no eyes and it's like a vampire and always has this ear out. And then it's mouth right here ready to like siphon. But all of that's right there. Easy to see. See him right here. He's sticking that thing into somebody. A man. This man's head is perfect. You can follow the line right around. Everything will match out perfectly. This man that's having something done to his eyes. This thing is sticking that gator right into him. Right there. 
on this side you can see what I've shown is like Quetzalcoatl uh, what's running the Catholic Church in the world now and he wears this little hat right here just like this and when the big head wound happens they keep showing that that what is deemed as our dog like we're connected to the dog star Sirius that that's part of where our soul comes from and comes down here to the earth that's what keeps being mapped out that we keep seeing and on our soul's journey after our journey here in our fleshly form we're supposed to move on to like the Pallades to go to heaven to cloud nine that guy there and he's taking out the dog right here you can see a dog just like this and it's having something messed with its eyes because they're at a window to our soul so this is being taken out of this man he's taking the mark of the beast and this big guy is stealing his dog and the little horn is putting in <coughs> this dragon type thing see it even has a little horn on it and it's going into him all of that is right there see his hat even <clears throat> well they're doing more right here this thing is shown to be like in the movie the fifth up the fifth element Zorg or whatever coming with this animal now we are nearing what's known as the fifth age even in Daniel's in the book of Daniel he talks of a statue and it shows four ages we're at the end of that now we're getting ready to enter the fifth age the age of the beast practically the mark of the beast coming even when Nibiru could show up and these both the Illuminati and the Freemasons and the Catholic Church all show that Nibiru the dark planet planet X is coming it is in the Bible written of as the destroyer that was last here during the Exodus it is what brought the plagues when Moses was here the Lord Jesus Christ proved that he can control it when it passed over all of the Hebrews on when it took all the firstborn and everything during the time of the Exodus but here he is with this critter this guy right here coming and he works for the Dark Lord if you will right here in this man's hand you can see this crazy thing even with the eyes stop the tape in between here and take a look if you wish right there and he has this stick going right up the nose into the eye and he's licking the stick like licking off of the soul and this thing is putting the mark of the beast on his head right there this stick thing going right up into the man just like that so that's what we have for the whole thing you have this guy taking the dog out of out of us you just like Wizard of Oz don't let him take your dog but there he is he's taking and stealing this dog thing takes it away this guy is sticking in giving everybody the mark of the beast and he's sticking in this reptilian type thing this thing is doing the mark of the beast and they're actually pulling the soul out and doing things with it it's all real and it's all around us and it's all right here you watch my channel I will show this over and over and over again this is big and it's real just as I said before the Lord Jesus Christ created all of the universe most people even who think of him as God only think he created maybe this world he created everything he makes all of these things bow to him and as Jesus told John when he was baptized he said let all scripture be fulfilled even this part of scripture will have its time and will be fulfilled until it's over until Jesus stops it confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus believe in your heart God hath raised him from the dead and you'll be saved hallelujah so we see it all around here that we have verified it everywhere we see that they put it in the movies this guy coming right there with everything so we've, we're verifying it in every way possible
it's all real so call out to the Lord Jesus and he can hear you call out to him and tell him to put you and your family in his book of remembrance thank you very much everybody hallelujah